everyone and welcome to my new channel essentials with amani i will be covering majority of what i know and what i do during my newborn sessions so come along with me and hopefully you learn a thing or two with me so during this series i will be releasing a fair bit of videos with instructions on how i pose for example i will be doing posing wrapped and unwrapped on the posing table and then i will be doing some placardi poses and then i'll also be doing some wrapped and unwrapped poses on some props of mine so let's go okay so from the hands under the chin pose we go into the very famous and very loved and also very frowned upon and people are so scared to do it the froggy pose which is honestly the most easiest pose you can do once you master it it is so easy so so easy so from here i will lift baby again hand under hold from the bottom and i Similar. will give a cuddle and then i'll get a few different As I'm shots cuddling, different angles baby loves it. directly in front from above so i turn the pillow so it's facing me so we got and then i move on to the, the actual the next side facing me and then it starts to decline from the back so i've got that facing me directly now this little pillow, we don't need it anymore unless I find that the baby is too far down and then I'll bring it just to prop baby up a bit but otherwise I don't really need it and we can move the pillow that we've been using for the legs we can pop that out of the way and this is where I get parents to come join me because I don't have an assistant, I work by myself so parents will come um, I'll instruct them on what to do and when to do it and I'll tell them I'll let you know and I'll do it with you as well step by step so from here I'll get parents to stand on either side of the posing table and I'll instruct them as soon as I put baby down to, to tap them on the back for me just to help soothe them and if we need a dummy to assist we will give the baby a dummy or a pacifier so then I will place baby at the bottom of the pillow where there's no lifting of any sort bend the legs and then i will place one hand under the chin and some fix the head the bonnet rosary beads under the chin which is why i leave it with the, the other hand here so i use the islamic one and if my other clients want me to add like that. some of their rosary beads for their Done. religion i will incorporate all right now i never leave the baby but because our baby isn't real i'm gonna leave her so that is literally how the froggy looks you can adjust the feet to show i try to keep the feet exactly touching the back of the elbows which gives baby a bit more support but to be honest with you most, most babies don't like this kind of bending so i'm happy for their feet to be tucked in now you can do this shot naked, you can do with a headband, you can do no headband, you can do with clothes on, you can do a wrap, don't have a wrap on me, you can do a wrap just to cover the back and you can just have the feet sticking out. And then, so if I was to pose, if this baby was a real baby, what I'll do is I will hold the baby's hand, get the shot for the composite shot because it's two in one as I never leave the baby and then once I get that shot I will ask the parents to hold baby's head from here just to hold it but if they feel when my hands are moving that baby is slipping don't let go so if the baby is fine to go parents hold head like this I will get the shot again and then in Photoshop I will merge them both together so that is how you do the froggy pose very easy once you master it it's not hard at all that's it thank you so much for watching my video today if you are interested in more tips and tricks from your favorite newborn photographer please follow me on all my socials youtube instagram and facebook and please subscribe and make sure you hit the bell button below so you are notified whenever i release one of my new videos